Good evening, and welcome to a special report that could redefine the future of aviation as we know it. Tonight, we're not just talking about a new airplane, we're witnessing a pivotal moment in the balance of global power, technology, and ambition. The world is watching as the skies themselves become a new arena for competition and innovation. For decades, two names have dominated the world's airways, Boeing and Airbus. Their aircraft have carried billions of passengers, shaped economies and set the standard for international travel. But now, a bold new challenger steps onto the runway, hailing from the east and ready to disrupt the status quo. Meet the Comac C929, China's first long-haul wide-body passenger jet. This remarkable aircraft has just completed its maiden voyage, a flight that marks a turning point not only for China, but for the entire aviation industry. The C929 accomplished a non-stop journey of 12,000 kilometers, connecting Shanghai to Western Europe in a single, seamless flight. This achievement demonstrates not just technical capability, but a new level of confidence on the world stage. This was far more than a routine test flight. It was a bold declaration of China's growing expertise in aerospace engineering, the result of years of research, innovation, and determination by thousands of dedicated engineers and technicians. The implications of this flight are profound. It could reshape global trade routes, alter the dynamics of international business, and even influence the delicate balance of global politics. In this program, we'll trace the C929's journey from a bold concept on the drawing board to its groundbreaking flight across continents. We'll explore the challenges faced, the breakthroughs achieved, and the vision that drove this project forward. The question now looms, how will industry giants Boeing and Airbus respond to this new competition? Will they innovate, collaborate, or fight to maintain their dominance? And what does this mean for airlines and passengers around the globe? Could this spark a new era of affordable, efficient, and comfortable long-haul travel? The C929 is more than just an airplane. It's a symbol of China's ambition and a cornerstone of the Made in China 2025 initiative, which aims to transform the nation into a leader in high-tech manufacturing. As we unpack the significance of this historic flight, We'll analyze its ripple effects in boardrooms, government offices, and airline headquarters worldwide. The decisions made in response to the C929 could shape the future of aviation for decades to come. The race for the skies has a formidable new competitor. The world is watching, and the next chapter in aviation history is about to unfold. Stay with us as we dive deeper into the C929's historic leap. To truly grasp the significance of the C929, we need to understand the broader story of China's aviation ambitions, a journey marked by determination, innovation, and a relentless pursuit of self-reliance. Let's look back at how far China has come in its quest to build a world-class aviation industry. In the early days, China's aviation sector was in its infancy, with only a handful of domestically produced aircraft like the Shanghai Y-10 and most airports filled with foreign planes. For much of the 20th century, China depended heavily on imported technology and expertise from established Western manufacturers. Boeing and Airbus jets dominated Chinese skies, and the idea of a homegrown competitive passenger jet seemed almost out of reach. The dream of building a jet that could rival global giants was distant, but it never faded. Each setback only strengthened the resolve of Chinese engineers and policymakers. This reliance on foreign technology was seen as a vulnerability, a gap that needed to be closed for reasons of both national pride and security. The desire for self-sufficiency became a driving force behind China's aviation strategy. Everything began to change in the early 2000s. China's economy was booming, and with it, the demand for air travel soared. Airports expanded, passenger numbers skyrocketed, and the need for a robust domestic aviation industry became urgent. Beijing recognized that relying on foreign manufacturers for its growing aviation needs was not a sustainable path. The country needed its own champions in the skies. In 2008, the Commercial Aircraft Corporation of China, or COMAC, was established. Its mission, to design and build competitive commercial aircraft that could stand shoulder to shoulder with the best in the world. The ARJ-21 regional jet was COMAC's first major project. It was a steep learning curve, but every challenge faced and lesson learned paved the way for more ambitious projects. The successful development and launch of the C919 marked a major milestone. It proved that China could design and build a modern, single-aisle jet. But the real prize was the wide-body market, dominated by the likes of Boeing's 787 and Airbus's A350. 
The C929 is the culmination of decades of effort. Designed to connect China with cities across the globe, it represents a bold step onto the world stage, building on the hard-won experience from the ARJ21 and C919. The C929 aims for true technological independence, with advanced materials, systems, and design. The C929 isn't just intended for domestic routes, it's designed to compete globally, challenging the dominance of established Western manufacturers and opening new possibilities for Chinese aviation. More than just an aircraft, the C929 is a symbol, a declaration of China's ambition to become a true leader in global aviation, shaping the future of flight for decades to come. The C929 story began in 2017 as a joint venture between Comac and Russia's UAC, named CR929. It aimed to combine Russian design with China's manufacturing might. However, geopolitical tensions and differing visions strained the partnership. By 2023, Comac took primary control, rebranding it as the C929. This shift allowed Comac to focus on a robust domestic supply chain. The C929's development faced challenges, especially in engine production. While initial prototypes use foreign engines, the goal is a domestic powertrain. The C929 stands ready to challenge the global order. On November 11, 2025, the C929 prototype took off from Shanghai. Its mission, a 12,000-kilometer flight, a direct challenge to Boeing and Airbus. The flight lasted 14 hours, monitored by Comac and Kaxi experts. The aircraft flew over China, Central Asia, and Europe before returning. Upon landing, it was celebrated with water cannons and official accolades. The chief designer declared the C929 a reality, a victory for Chinese engineering. The flight's data will refine the aircraft's design for production. This successful mission is a powerful marketing tool for Comac. The C929's capabilities are now proven to potential global customers. The world watched, and China delivered. The C929 is ready to reshape aviation. The C929's flight shook Boeing and Airbus, forcing a reassessment. The future arrived sooner than expected, impacting financial markets. Stock prices for Boeing and Airbus dipped, signaling investor anxiety. Analysts questioned the duopoly's market share, especially in Asia. Airlines worldwide are considering the C929 as a new option. The political reaction is significant. The C929 is a geopolitical tool. It enhances China's technological prestige and global influence. The era of Western monopoly on high-tech manufacturing is ending. The C929 signals a new, multipolar world of technology and industry. We spoke with Dr. Richard Abulafia, an aviation analyst, for insights. The C929's flight moves it from ambitious project to imminent reality. However, challenges remain in production, certification, and market acceptance. The supply chain, especially engines, is a critical hurdle. The true game-changer is a fully domestically produced aircraft. Comac's focus will be on securing orders from Chinese airlines. Dr. Abulafia warns against protectionism, urging innovation instead. The c 929 success should catalyze innovation in the West. Boeing and Airbus must invest in R&D to stay competitive. The C929 is a catalyst for a new era of aerospace innovation. The best response is to compete and innovate. The race is on. The C929's arrival reshapes a trillion-dollar market. Comac aims to capture a significant share of the wide-body market. This challenges Boeing and Airbus, especially in China. The C929 forces them to compete on price and innovation. Suppliers face a new dynamic, balancing partnerships with Comac. The C929 could reshape global trade and travel routes. It aligns with China's Belt and Road Initiative, promoting connectivity. The C929 is a tool for trade, tourism, and investment. It strengthens China's geopolitical relationships. The C929 is a symbol of China's technological prowess. It boosts national prestige and offers an alternative to Western dependency. Aircraft sales become a diplomatic tool, shifting allegiances. The C929 enhances China's strategic autonomy, reducing foreign pressure. It supports military applications, enhancing power projection. Western capitals must decide how to respond. Containment could backfire, pushing nations closer to Beijing. A constructive approach focuses on innovation and cooperation. The C929 marks a new era of technological competition and cooperation. 
The C-929's first flight marks not just a technical achievement, but the beginning of a bold new chapter in global aviation. This moment signals China's determination to become a major force in the skies, challenging the long-standing dominance of Western manufacturers. In the coming months and years, COMAC will focus on refining the C-929's design, conducting rigorous test flights, and addressing any technical challenges that arise. The path to commercial service is complex, requiring countless hours of engineering and innovation. Achieving international certification is a critical milestone. Without it, the C-929 cannot enter key global markets. Inspectors from around the world will scrutinize every detail, ensuring the aircraft meets the highest safety and performance standards. The future of aviation will be shaped by relentless innovation, new materials, smarter avionics, and more efficient engines. The race to develop the next generation of aircraft is intensifying. Boeing and Airbus, the industry's giants, now face a formidable new competitor. To maintain their lead, they must accelerate their own research and development, pushing the boundaries of what's possible in commercial flight. The arrival of the C-929 means there is no room for complacency. Every player in the industry must adapt, innovate, and respond to this new era of competition. This fierce competition could spark a new golden age of aerospace innovation, with breakthroughs that benefit airlines and travelers alike. For passengers, this means more choices, improved comfort, and potentially lower fares as airlines gain access to new aircraft and routes. The flying experience could be transformed in ways we can only begin to imagine. As competition heats up, the world will become even more connected. New routes will open, making travel faster, easier, and more accessible for people everywhere. The C-929 stands as a powerful symbol of China's ambition and technological prowess. It demonstrates what can be achieved through vision, investment, and relentless effort. By breaking the decades-long duopoly, the C-929 has announced the arrival of a new player on the world stage, forever changing the landscape of commercial aviation. The story is far from over. With intense competition ahead, the race for the skies has only just begun. The next chapter promises to be even more exciting.